If you're working on a video or presentation, you'll probably want to illustrate it with images from the internet. But you don't want to steal from other people and use their work without permission. So how can you find images that you're free to use in a presentation uh, without worrying about copyright? That's where the Creative Commons comes in. The Creative Commons is a way for people to license their work quickly and easily to others so that they can share it with the world and let others use their work uh, for creative purposes. There are a lot of different ways to search for things with the Creative Commons license. One of my favorite is the Flickr advanced search. So let's say you're doing a video on how the narrative arc in digital storytelling is like a clothesline that you hang your visuals on. So I'd like to illustrate that idea with an actual picture of a clothesline. So I'm going to start just by searching on Flickr for clothesline. clothesline. And we see what comes up. And very quickly we can see, oh look, here we have the option for any license. So you can see, I can see all these pictures and when people upload their photos to Flickr, Flickr asks them, what license do you want to apply to this? And they have several options for choosing a Creative Commons license, including one that says, yes, you can use this for commercial purposes if you want, or you can use it for things where you're going to modify it. Maybe you want to crop it or rotate it or flip it or, or just use a part of it um, or both of those things. So since this is for a school project, I'm going to just say modifications allowed to give myself the most options. And here we can see all sorts of different images of clotheslines, all of which have been designated by their creators as free for me to use. So this is a likely looking image, uh, courtesy of Grant McDonald. And it was taken a few years ago. And here we see some rights reserved and you'll, come to recognize these little icons. Uh, no commercial use allowed. Um, if I open this up, I'll actually get the full explanation from the Creative Commons. All right, so I'm free to share and adapt it, but I must give attribution and I can't use it for making money, essentially. And I'm not gonna donate right now, sorry. So, if we go back to Flickr, we can see there's options to download it. I'm going to download it at just the biggest size they have. And now I'm free to use it in my work as long as I give credit back to Grant McDonald for this great image of a clothesline. And you can do that by including the link in your video or presentation. Um, and you'll often see these Flickr links underneath photos that other people have used. So that's the easiest way to find photos that you're free to use. And there are lots of other sites that will also help you find Creative Commons licensed photos. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to us. And good luck with your presentation or video.